Back inside Camper Pavilion, just a couple of minutes away from SMU meeting UConn in tonight's UConn women's basketball game on SNY. Thank you, Justine. Good crowd here on a Wednesday night in stores, ready for the 10th meeting all time between SMU and UConn in the opening tip. Won by UConn in their home way. Terrific coach, one of, and he's one of our favorite coaches in the league, no doubt. Collier. Nice hands by Collier. Rolling, leading the conference in block shots with 41. That's number 20 for Nafisa, who scores on the other end. Collier. Uh, she is just picking up where she left off in Philadelphia. Perfect from the field so far. And the 6'2 junior, Mackenzie Ellis, will not be able to guard Collier in that low post. Tipped by Samuelson to Dangerfield, back to Samuelson. Being fouled. A moment ago, here's Williams. Dangerfield rattles in a three. Dangerfield behind the back dribble. Beautiful feed to Collier. Yeah, there was some body, body action. How about this? How about behind the back? Change direction in traffic. Pass the ball to exactly where Collier needed it. Pretty play. 12 points a game. Had 12 points in 29 minutes last time out against UCF. Walker. Samuelson. Wilson had turned around. She turned back around just in time. And now a wild scramble for the basketball. Ends up in the hands of UConn. We had a player and an official in the first row. <laughs> Walker. White. Hounded by Molly Bent. And knocked away by Samuelson. And a clean breakout for Samuelson. Samuelson flies in and gets the offensive rebound. That's the sixth offensive rebound for UConn. Samuelson, is this the one? It is. SMU will be UConn ball. Nice kick out from the low post. See, all the blue jerseys were focused on Collier in that low post. Put up by Paige Bayless, another freshman, six foot five out of Queensland, Australia. Samuelson to White. 14, 39% overall from the field. Good job by Dangerfield telling Walker, no, pass it over there. And Williams. See it coming. Samuelson took it away. Another turnover for SMU. That's their 12th. And look how quickly the piece of Collier gets down the floor. Player, she's savvy. She's, she's going to find an opening. She'll finish. She is competitive, too. Samuelson Ooh. knocks down the three-pointer. 14 points now for Katie Lou. Two of eight from outside the three-point line. The pressure in the backcourt continues. Another turnover for SMU. That's number 14. Dangerfield looking away to Walker for two. Crystal is first in the league in assist-to-turnover ratio. 2.7 to 1. <laughs> Didn't even look at Walker. Knew she was there. 55% free-throw shooter. It is a challenge for her. Bent the entry to Collier. So an assist and a steal for Molly back-to-back. -back. Four seconds, Walker corner three is good. I thought they at least competed and didn't shut down. Great ball movement by UConn, open luck in the corner. That's how the first half ended, and that's how the second half starts for Megan Walker. On 16 points, six rebounds, four blocks, two steals. Terrific pass from Samuelson. Talk about it. And SMU is battling. They were a plus two in rebounding margin in the first half. They had 10 offensive rebounds. Samuelson, that's her new go-to spot. Collier rips down the rebound. Two on one the other way. Samuelson back to Williams. Chip away. That's what he told Justine at halftime. Collier outside. Williams sets her feet. Drains a three. Collier, Dangerfield. Dangerfield back for Collier. Samuelson wide open for three. Samuelson, Collier rolls for the basket from SMU. Samuelson tipped it 
Dangerfield wins the race for the basketball, and Dangerfield drops it down to Samuelson for two. One minute to go, third quarter. Crystal hands it off. Another assist for Crystal Dangerfield. Is that they've been getting, and you're seeing right here in the corner, this group is getting a chance here. Shot clock winding down. What are they going to do with it? Molly Bent does something with it right there and takes it in for two. And it's a freshman to a freshman, so how much? you got to give Williams credit for not turning it over. you got to come to the ball. Tomorrow turns and scores. She's actually minoring in musical theater. She says she sees herself on Broadway if basketball doesn't work out. Wow, it's nice to have those kinds of choices. Williams for two. And pop up on a Broadway marquee somewhere. So I'll, I'll keep an eye open for that. 145 to go, Coombs, and it's Williams again. UConn wins again. Six wins in a row for the Huskies. They beat SMU by 40 here tonight in stores.